Karen Brandon, I uh, go to Sydney High School. Uh, Alex Green, also Sydney. Great, so uh, tell me what you guys did this morning. What was your character? What did you do? My character, I was David, who is a speed addict and depressed. And so I just went through the challenge of his life of having three stepkids and a wife and having no way to support them. Doesn't have a job, won't get hired, and being turned down by all these different agencies. Um, I was playing Mark, and Mark needs to find employment to support his two children and his common law life. And he's really struggling to do this, and uh, he's living off of Ontario Works funds, but the check ran out and he has to find a way to support his family. So what was the hardest thing you guys had to do while you were playing these characters? Um, I didn't think the hardest part was playing the character. I thought the hardest part was meeting the character themselves and putting a face to the actual scenario you've been running through because it sort of just puts in perspective that these are real people. It's not just a cue card you're playing. You're not acting. You're, this is someone's real life that they went through and the struggles they've actually done. And it means a lot more than just reading it. Um, I'd have to agree with Brandon on that point. I think that it was really difficult to see how tangible it was and that these people are Canadians and they, they live in our society and they're struggling so much and we're not doing as much as we could to help them. And knowing that um, you know, I go home to a stable home and a stable family and I'm taking advantage of that where there are people in Canada who we're supposed to be supporting who are struggling. So what's the takeaway for you guys? What's going to stick in your head when you walk out the doors today? What's going to stick in my head is sort of that poverty is not something that's all about out of our country. It's all in Africa and that. It's poverty is in our backyard and it's going to be us that changes it. No one else is going to come to it. Um, I think the takeaway for me was mostly that what Brandon said. It is in our backyard, but we can also change it. We have the abilities. I mean, we had students here who did a think tank for 45 minutes and came up with ways that could significantly reduce uh, poverty. So if we as high schools high school students can do this, then I don't see why the government can and why we can't work together. Great. That's it. Thank you.